Jocelyn Gouvenex Bordeaux were in terrible form after winning just one of their last 11 league outings and free falling down the table into 15th. They faced a Montpellier side who were firmly rooted in mid table but who boasted the best defence in the league after conceding just 13 goals in 18 matches. Goals were an issue though for Michel Desacarin's team. Their top scorer Giovanni Sio only had four to his name this campaign. It was a Sambia free kick who called Prior into action early on, denying him his first goal of the season. Prior once again on cue as Montpellier came forwards. This time, Aguiar forcing the Bordeaux goalkeeper to make a save. Nil-nil at half-time in a match lacking a spark lacking that individual talent that would turn it into a real contest. Much to look forward to though in the second 45 minutes under the watchful gaze of Govanek. And once again, it was a Sambia free kick which got us going. And it was another good save by Prior, one you would expect the goalkeeper to make. Giovanni Sio then chances luck from range and it was almost a goal of the season. Desperately unlucky, perfect balance, great shot, it's floating around. Prior's lucky to see that one bounce off his crossbar. Montpellier kept coming forwards. And it was a phenomenal strike by Ikone, which found the back of the net. Powerful strike. Player not celebrating but on the replays you could see that Prior had to do much better the ball fast but he should have saved it Sambia making way for Mbenzia and 44 seconds later the Montpellier substitute scored when he picked up the ball cutting side and what a strike that is bending it into the bottom corner his fourth goal of the season. It's a good run, but he's in acres of space. As Bordeaux were pushing to get an equaliser. And Priot couldn't do anything about that one. Matters become even worse for Govanek's team. 15th in the league. A chance for them to regroup during the break. Montpellier, on the other hand, climb up into seventh. 